Hi everyone, this is Jason with Lightspeed and I'm here to help you get started with your brand new system. Lightspeed can keep track of all of your customers for you and today we're going to show you how it does that by adding a couple of customers to your account. Let's get started. Saving a customer's details in your account will allow you to keep track of their activity in your store. To add a customer to your database, simply click on Customers, followed by Customers, followed by New Customer in the top right. This will take us to the Customer Creation screen. The first thing we'll want to do is assign this customer a type. This customer might not have a specific type, but the type allows you to do things like apply a 10% student discount to any one of the type student, for example. If a broader discount doesn't apply, you can always set up this particular customer with a discount that applies only to them from a list of available discounts. Similarly, if this customer is, for example, tax exempt, you can switch them from the default sales tax set up in your system to a specific sales tax that will apply only to them. From here, it's simply a matter of entering in their personal details and then clicking save. You can enter as many or as few of the personal details as you like, but at least a first and last name is highly recommended. Once you've created your customer, you'll be able to see their sales history in your store, if they have any outstanding layaways or special orders or quotes. You can track payments they've made to you in the past and track their credit account. You can get more specific information on all of these things on our help center. You can also click on checkout, which will bring you straight to the sales screen with this customer already attached. If you've already added some products to the transaction and realize you haven't taken down the customer's name, not to worry. While you do have the search bar to find existing customers in your database, you can also click on plus new. That will take you to the customer creation screen we saw earlier. Here you can enter in their details on the fly. Save changes and attach them to the sale. And from there, you simply complete the transaction as normal. As I said, there's lots more helpful videos and tutorials on our help center, so don't be afraid to check those out. And thanks very much for watching.